if you search for Lego Mindstorm and you go to the Lego website, you can tell that this one's the Lego website. You can click on the download section over here and here you can download the EV3 programmer app for an iOS or Android device. Here you can download it for your computer. So you need to have this one downloaded and installed on your computer. Next up, if you scroll down, you can see that there's extension software blocks for the sensors that you might have in your kit, but you might not have in the software. So I downloaded the gyro sensor block and the sound sensor block and the ultrasonic sensor block. If you open up the Lego Mindstorm EV3 software, you can see I opened up a new blank project. And if I come up to tools, I can come down to block import. Now I want to import those files that I just downloaded onto my computer. So I downloaded them to my desktop and I want to browse and you can see they are here. So I can open the gyro sensor and the sound sensor and the ultrasonic sensor down here to import them. And if I click import, it's just imported it into the software for me. And it says you must start the EV3 editor for this change to take effect. Once I restart, I will be able to see those blocks and I will be able to program those blocks in the software.